It, you hear that noise? That's a guy cutting my grass. That's the first time in 25 years anybody's ever cut my grass. I'm trying to keep the gold streak alive. The tide's low right now after the farmer's market. I'm headed in. Stand by. I forgot to tell you about it. That ring I found yesterday, this neighborhood here has a web page, uh, I guess that's what you call it, I don't know. I guess it's a nationwide thing, but you select certain neighborhoods. Anyway, it's called Next Door. So I posted a picture of it on there in case anybody locally lost it. And don't you know the lady down the street, husband lost it. Lost it eight years ago, Labor Day. Swimming in, he, he anchored his boat offshore and swimming into the beach and lost it. Eight years ago, Labor Day. How about that? That baby's been sitting there since Labor Day eight years ago. And I've hunted over that spot so many times in eight years. It just goes to show you that sometimes conditions change and you can find things. Just like that VMI ring I found in 2012 maybe. Guy lost it in 1997. Right in the surf at 19th Street. We hunt there every day in the land of Nada. A million of us have walked over it. But it took a hurricane to break it loose to get it up there where we could find it. Sheer blind luck. We'll see if we can get through this gate and find some more sheer blind luck. Stand by. Supposed to be here right now, one o'clock, but as you can see, it's bright and sunny. Some clouds behind me. I don't know what the wave's gonna look like, maybe like yesterday. But they didn't get real bad until the tide started coming in hard. Oh, it looks okay now. Some waves, but nothing bad. Might be some looters here too. I got a feeling. But I ain't I don't know for sure. I don't see any yet as I make the turn. Oh, it looks like it's looted. Oh, I might see one down there. Stand by. That the clouds I was talking about. Okay, here we go. Inbound. We're going to the east today, where I see them two looters. I think it's two looters down there. Two looters down there now. Hello, a looter. No detector needed. Okie dokie. Look at that. That's relaxing right there. First hit a dime, I think. 12.43. Got to start somewhere. 12.43 is a good way. Why does it got to be so deep, though? I found a lot of dimes yesterday, remember? Got that ticket now, though. Oh, cruddy penny. Not a dime. A 12.43 penny. I don't like those. Ring in the scoop. Gold. Look at that. That's why it was so little. It rung up like that. The big stone is missing. But it looks like it should have a, a mate somewhere. We're going to have to go back and look around in this hole a little more. God, can you believe it? Holy jumping to leader. The streak is still alive. Hey, we got a 1206. A 12.06. We got that now, whatever that is. It looks like a damn cruddy penny. I was excited for a minute until I got that ticket. I hear it rattling. Oh, baby. Budweiser. King of beers. Three foot away, I got a 1244. Better be a dime this time. No, damn, a quarter. 
1244. A penny at, penny at 1243. And a quarter at 1244. I guess it's going to be a funny kind of day. wire we find. I call it battery wire. I don't know what it is. Some people say it comes out of drywalls. I don't know. I know we find it from time to time though. It feels like lead, you know. Damn. This is an odd one. It's a 10, a 10 12. That reads 1912. Well, 13 now. We'll, we'll two scoops off of it. Now it's nulled out. I think it's some kind of irony thing. Yep, 30, 32 number now. Good m number and sound is gone. Yeah, I take that back. There's something here. Whether it's good or bad, I don't know. A lot of iron around it. See? 15, I think we're going to have to move on to a different target. Sounds good one way or the other. Stand by, let me get a target I told you it was junk file cap piece of crap you. Twelve oh seven. Seven. Gone, gone already. Stand by, I don't know what that was. I can't even hear a sound out of the hole now. Seven, see it? I got my big scoop. Oh, I ain't gonna never find it unless it's just get caught, caught right in the bottom. Oh well, on we go. I hear something rattling. Oh, that's a dime. Odd. Oh, I said it's an odd day.
That's why I always get the jumpy number. Lead, brass, stainless steel. And a thing on the end. With two more. Uh, I told you it was going to be a hard day. Hard sounds, anyway. I was thinking a quarter, 1246. I don't know what it is. It looks like brass or something. Part of a light bulb again, maybe. Shotgun shell or something? Flare? Who knows? But it sounded good. Seals must be having another operation. This is the second, this is the third helicopter hit it that way. That's the ones they jump out of. In Fort Bragg. Last year I was in the army, I worked at brigade, no, battalion headquarters. And we had to make pay jumps every month. And we were lucky enough to be able to take our car, drive, drive to the drop zone, get in the Huey, forward to a door and jump, go straight up, jump straight out, come back to our car, drive back to the office. I got a silver sound here, it might be a penny. Huey. Now that was a strange, no, that's a dime. That was a strange feeling jumping out of a helicopter the first time. Because your chute didn't rope right away because you were always going down, you know. But after the first time, I got used to it. And I like that part driving to the drop zone, jumping out and coming back. Those were the days. 168 pounds. Run four or five miles every morning. Ha! B Company. Light Weapons Infantry. 11B4P. Bullet Launcher. Extraordinaire. This says it's 34, might be a penny. Jumped up to a 35. I jumped in the scoop. Come out of there, baby. I don't see nothing. Oh, I see a bunch of stuff. Oh, I see that penny. Oh, I see that in there. Look at that nice baby. Working in and out. I'm turning around now and going back out. There don't seem to be much in here at all. But when I get out just below the screen, peck, you know, pecker deep. That's where all the targets have been. Just been some junk in here. All right, they ought to be coming into range right now. We're right in the right depth. Yep, there's a 38 right there. But it's very scratchy. 1230. That's it. It's really scratchy. Seven inches deep. I think we'll take a scoop off of it and see what it sounds like. I got a feeling I'm going to leave it though. Unless it sounds good with this scoop off. That, that knows out. So we'll leave that baby. Beaver found a, a 750 925 mix last night at the Landonata with uh, blue, maybe emeralds? No, sapphires or something.
can probably see it on the Treasure Depot this afternoon. It may be on there now. I haven't been on there this morning. Treasure Depot under the surfing sand. A little thin, thin looking ring, but really nice looking. Ratty down here too, 1206, but ratty. I think we're gonna leave it too. Got two scoops off of it. Oh, okay. oh, I see it. We got it on the second scoop. I told you it was ratty. So don't get excited, okay? Why? It's uh about three inches over the screen. We got it. I hear rattling. I hear rattling. That's a fishing lure. A Hopkins. Look at that. That's a nice bait right there, buddy. You usually got a treble hook right there. Big treble hook. But that's missing. Okay, onward we go. We're going back inshore now. Clouds are hanging around, but that's supposed to do that. I noticed some nice cheerleaders on the beach today, but what few they are are nice. Uh oh, got a hit. 1241. I shouldn't waste my time with this damn thing right here. But it's a nice day in the neighborhood. Baby. Jumped up to a 42. I have it. No, oh, it's a weird. Looks like a. No, it's not even that. I don't know what it is. A square. A piece of something sticking out of it. Well, 14 solid. Supposed to be five cents. Couple sinkers and I got a nice twelve oh nine right here. Seven inches deep. I hear some rattling. A cruddy penny. Ha! What is going on here? I have to take it. Screaming 1244. First scoop. Another penny. Five in the scoop. I don't think I like it. Looks like aluminum to me. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. More aluminum. I just happened to think about something I said earlier. 
I, I told y'all a fib. When we're talking about the guy cutting the grass, I said that's the first time somebody's cut my grass in 25 years. Well, that was a mistake. I, I should have said that's the first time anybody cuts Chris's grass in 25 years. This is not my grass, it's her grass. But I've been cutting it since 88, so it's actually longer than 25 years. Stand by. 24, 12, 26 jumper. Might be a sinker or something, you know. Still in the hole, I can tell you that. But it's like 25 better now than 24 or 26. I hear something rattling. Feels like a sinker. Oh no, it's worse. I don't know what it is. More crap out. Uh oh, it's an old car. Damn, that baby's been here. There might be a Model T. It even got wheels on it. Looks like a Hummer to me. Can't be too old. They haven't been around very long. Okay. 1205 I got a feeling I don't like it Jumping a little bit now That's jumped to 0110. Could be a nice bottle cap. Stand by. Penny. One of the white crusty ones again. Damn, look at this. Nice boat. That's a beautiful boat. Key West. Yes, sir. That's the nicest boat I've seen today right there. I imagine. We got to go back in the hole now. The same same hole the penny came out is a 12 1204. A solid 1204 in that hole. Might be another penny. We dug a penny. That one was 1205. Damn, that's a nice boat. I ain't kidding you. Some rocks that time, and the sound's gone. All right, fell out over here. Yep, there it is, right there. Let's see if we can get it. We didn't get it that time. I think it's going to fall through each time. Whatever it is, it's small. Okay, on we go. Back to that boat. Good gracious, what a nice boat. I like the color, too. It's right in my favorite spot. Yes, sir, I told you that was a nice one. Well, 22, solid.
Got it, whatever it is. It's coming aboard. Looks like the bottom of a can. It is the bottom of a can. A fine one, too. Look at that. Back here, Scoopo. I thought I felt a raindrop, but so far I haven't seen but one or two. Got some kind of sound right here. I can concentrate on it. Kind of a scratchy, jumpy sound. 12, 13. Sometimes. Ha! I think it's some kind of deep iron thing. One more scoop and see. I got. I don't hear it anymore. I don't see nothing in the scoop. On we go. Oh man, what is that? False alarm, I guess. Seems the further I go to the east, the less I find. I'm going to turn around right here and go back that way. I mean, go back to the west. I've been about a, a eighth of a mile. No. Yeah, maybe a quarter of a mile. I'm going to get in here about screen deep, and I'm going to turn right. And then I'm going to hunt back to where I put in that, and then I'm going to go back and forth in and out again. All right, we're headed back that way. Blood pressure's down a little bit now. Things are better. Stand by. 13. Five cent, I think, maybe. I hear clinging around in there. That's a rock I hear. Penny again. Of course. Twelve oh five. Whatever it was, it fell through. It's right here. That's it. Twelve oh five.
we go. Twelve eighteen, solid. Solid twelve eighteen. But it feels it feels like I I mean it feels like something big. I don't think it's in a rig or anything. I see it now. Ah wonderful. I guess it's a can. Appears to be a can. If it looks like a can, and you think it is a can, it must be a can. Put that in my pouch and throw that away. Uh, I think it's trying to catch me now. But it looks like it's off in the distance. You see it's not too much right here. And all the people are still hanging around. They ain't afraid. But it looks rough, don't it? But it looks like it's moving to the west. Northwest. Okay. Well, 15. Rock. Whatever it is, it's gone. Moved over to the right. Right there. It's trying to surround me now. I got one over there. All right, one there. It, it sweeps all the way around now. Only one little clear spot is right there. Ain't finding much either. That's going to be a big house right there, three stories. You see how much bigger it is than the other big new one right next to it. That's a monster. God. Iron. Thought we had a hit. I mean, we did have a hit, but the wrong kind. Waves are picking up a little bit too. Not as bad as yesterday though. Stand by. That's Thor and Zeus. They just showed up. They just said, go home, Grave Digger Max. Get in the recliner. Get a shower. Get something to eat. I'm headed that way. See you tomorrow. Surf Church Sunday. Actually, it'd be Surf Church afternoon. restaurants with smaller boxes than that. <laughs> God almighty. That's the biggest electric box I've ever seen for a house. Well, there it is. This is like a belt buckle or something it looks like. I ain't sure of that, I just think that. You saw that nice car. 
five gray matters, six dimes. That's a little 10K with uh, real ice. The big, big ice stone is missing. One went right there. At least I think there was a stone there. A few cruddy pennies, which you saw most of. That's it. Like I said, see you tomorrow for Surf Church in the afternoon. I'm going to test these diamonds. I already tested them once so the green light comes on. See the green light? Real ice. It's tiny, but it's real. And the big one went right there. It's gone. Or two, whatever went there. But it's missing. But that's okay. It's the way life is sometimes.